All right, everybody, welcome back. This is Kyle Bazzi, president here at Benzinga.com for the Benzinga FinTech Awards. We're looking for the most innovative people, products, and companies that have one goal in mind, to help you make money. Up next is Betterment and CEO and founder John Stein. John, what's going on, man? How are you, Kyle? It's great to be here. I'm fantastic. As you can tell, I'm pretty pumped up about this interview. Um, robo advisors, as you guys are called at Betterment, is a huge topic in the fintech world. Um, before we jump into the platform and exactly what you guys are doing, tell me a little bit about you, how you started the company, and exactly what does Betterment do? Sure. I started the company back in 2010. We launched, and I, uh, I started this after working in finance for uh, five years learning about how banks and brokers work, learning about how they make their money. I'd studied uh, economics and behavior as an undergrad at Harvard. I got my CFA, so I'd been investing and, and looking at uh, smart ways to invest for myself and, and for our clients for many years. And I found that there was no great technology out there that would just do all the right things for me and do it in an automated, intelligent way. And I built Betterment first and foremost for myself and my peers. Uh, I was shopping it around to, to lots of people and saying, hey, would you, would you use a tool like this? And everyone I talked to who had a bit of money, was, uh, was trying to make the most of it, uh, said, yes, this sounds like exactly what I'm looking for. So it was built for us. All right, so paint a framework for us real quick. Before Betterment, what were people doing and what are you trying to get them to do now? Before Betterment, people were uh, confronted with uh, a range of uh, many different types of investments. There's target date funds, there's options, there's currencies, there's stocks and bonds, there's all these, there's mutual funds, etc. There's all these different things that you could do to invest. And a lot of them are garbage. Um, a lot of them are just absolute crap. Uh, and, uh, and the ones that are good are hard to manage. Uh, so if you, even if you were doing all the things right uh, and you had focused in on a passively index-based portfolio of uh, uh, Vanguard and, uh, and iShares ETFs, you still couldn't really manage that for tax efficiency. You still couldn't rebalance it in a tax-efficient way. You still were subject to behavioral tendencies that I saw in myself and I saw in everyone I've ever known who's, who's been investing, of uh, trying to time the market and trying to um, sort of outsmart yourself and ending up uh, trailing the market. So what we did is we built a system that automates away a lot of the, the challenges of investing. Uh, it makes smart choices for you and it makes you a smarter investor by giving you your own data back in really intelligent ways and by saving you on taxes. All right, so um, so now you guys are pretty much automating and, and bringing technology into the realm um, for the average person. Um, is it working? And, and, I, and I say that as a very broad question, but getting people over um, themselves out of their own way, uh, obviously being an econ and, and behavioral uh, guy, is it working with what you guys are doing? It's been amazing to see how well it's working. I mean, there's a couple ways to measure is it working. First, uh, our, our growth, uh, you know, we've, we've been adding customers like, like crazy, and I, we'll probably talk more about that in a minute, but we've been growing about 400% every year since I launched this business year over year. Uh, is it working for individual customers? Yes. So we measure the behavior gap of our customers, what they should earn versus what they actually do earn. And at Betterment, I'm pleased to say that there's almost no gap, that people are actually getting the returns of the market, that they're actually getting what, what, they, what they should earn on their investments versus at the typical uh, brokerage. And we've you know, surveyed maybe seven different firms, and there's independent research institutes that do this kind of work an investor often gets only 50% or maybe at best 75% of what they should be getting from their investments. So in that behavioral angle, we've definitely improved people and we've made real advances on the tax efficiency of, of people's investments. I, in my own account, in everyone's account, I know um, they're, they're going to pay less tax this year uh, for the same amount of gains than they, than they would have in any year prior thanks to the innovations that we've brought to market. All right. So when um, someone comes in to, to Betterment here, um, can you walk us through exactly what, what would happen? Are you getting my preferences? How are you picking the different programs that are right for me? When uh, you come to Betterment, we ask you about your goals. Uh, and they could be, I want to save for retirement, I just want to build wealth, I want a safety net or a down payment on a house, whatever those goals are. And based on them and the time horizon to those goals, we recommend portfolios for our customers. 
then we manage those portfolios over time for tax efficiency, for low cost, for behavioral efficiency. We construct the portfolio using uh, it's a it's a an agnostic uh, open platform approach where we can use any ETF that's out there and we choose the very best ones in each asset class for being low cost, for being highly liquid and having a low bid ask spread. So how many of these portfolios and, and different plans do you have and who is constructing them? Everyone is unique. Everyone gets a personalized portfolio. It's always based on your goals and there are an infinite number of different portfolios that you could have based upon your goals. It's based on your goals and your time horizons. The portfolio uh, advice is automated based on uh, a very sophisticated mapping of risk to time horizon and then you, uh, the individual, can customize that if you like and we'll show you what that means for your returns over time. You can change the portfolio whenever you want you can add new goals that change your mix and will manage all of the taxes and all of the, the wash sales and those kinds of complicated things no matter what on every single transaction on every single trade. All right, now let's jump into the numbers a little bit more. So um, the platform's awesome. You guys are growing. What do those numbers look like? You know, is it you guys judge that by assets under management right now? Is it the number of accounts and active users? Can you talk a little bit about that? We measure all those things, and like I said, we've been growing at, at uh, about 400% every year uh, since I started the company four, four plus years ago. So it's been incredible to see. We now uh, have uh, the, the most funded accounts of uh, any independent investment advisor in the country. Uh, we've got over uh, 53,000 accounts today, and I think we're growing that by uh, about 1,000 new, new accounts per week. We, uh, we're continuing to, um, uh, to see faster and faster growth. Every month this year has been faster than the last. All right, so you guys have raised tens of millions of dollars, I think around 45 million, um, but with that obviously comes a lot of uh, attention, and there's a couple other companies out there um, that you guys are, I would say, competing with, but can you talk a little bit more in, in your words about the competitive landscape currently? Yeah, I, I tend not to, to spend too much time thinking about competitors. I know that what we're doing is unique. I know that we have uh, uh, the only system out there that's as beautiful and as automated uh, and as fast and as sophisticated as what we've built. And we just continue to, to refine that and make it better and focus on providing the best possible net returns to our customers. All right, before we get the 30-second elevator pitch here to wrap up on what makes you guys so special, as a fellow econ and behavioral guy, I love learning about what makes people tick. Um, why is this better for someone, you know, psychology-wise, that's allowing them to actually utilize tools, utilize the market um, to create a better financial future? What is it about that behavioral aspect of people um, that they needed betterment? So I think one of the coolest examples of uh, a behavior that, that we've seen in the application is that when we launched a Tax Impact Preview just a couple of months ago, we found a 60% reduction in the number of transactions that people made when they saw that they were going to incur a tax. So this is information that people have never before seen. It's what's the tax on a transaction that I'm about to make. It's predicting the future, uh, if you will. And, uh, and no one else shows you this. No one else has ever shown you this kind of information. When we show people this, which is something that's involved in every transaction, there's always a tax implication for, for that transaction, 60% uh, fewer people went through with it when they saw that they were going to have a taxable event. And that's an incredible finding. That means that more than half of the transactions that people are making, they're making without full information. And if they had full information, they might not do them. So I'm really pleased that we've been able to impact behavior so much through better transparency and better information. All right, now um, obviously the news came out and um, people want to know, you know, with the huge sums of money that um, some of the other companies like Wealthfront and Personal Capital have raised, are you guys planning on raising again? And what, you know, what are you guys doing with that 45 million? We are investing uh, our money in providing the best possible net returns and the best possible customer experience for our customers. And today, hands down, we have delivered that. If you ask anybody who's used the platform, who might have used other platforms, whether they be other startups or existing platforms, everyone agrees that we have 
the best platform in the space. We've got five-star rated iPhone and Android apps. Uh, people love our customer service and so on. That's what we're that's what we're continuing to invest in. I love it. A confident CEO is always a good CEO in my book. Um, tell me about the age group. So if I, I looked it back on 2014 as we're bringing the year to an end here. I think the two big themes were the generational shift from the baby boomers moving out, the millennials becoming the forefront of um, conversation, and then also mobile. Uh, where does Betterment fit in, in both of those? Mobile is incredibly important. Uh, this, uh, it, we see it more and more every day. Uh, today, something like 25% of our signups come from mobile. I think a year ago, it was closer to 5%. So we're seeing more and more adoption now. We are also seeing 25% of our customers are 50 plus, And that's a number that's been growing rapidly. We're doing more retirement accounts. We're doing more retirement planning. We've been building features for that demographic specifically because we see them as a valuable part of the business growing going forward. John, I love the company, dude. We're huge fans of it here at Benzinga. Um, let's get the 30-second elevator pitch to wrap it up here and talk about what you guys are doing in 2015. You know, the Benzinga FinTech Awards are all about companies, people, and products trying to innovate and create a new way or a better way to help people make money and a, um, obviously a better financial future. Uh, what makes Betterment so special in 30 seconds? Betterment is the obvious best answer to the question, what should I do with my money? We give you the best way to manage, grow, and protect your wealth for better net returns, net of taxes, net of costs, net of your behavior. There's nothing better you could be doing. That's what we're excited about. We continue to innovate, innovate in that direction. I'm excited about the Benzingo Awards. I think what you guys are doing is great, Kyle, and I love that you guys are uh, helping to draw awareness toward the the exciting uh, new tools, Betterment being the, the, the best among them that people can use to, to grow their money faster. Times are changing, John, and you guys are a big part of that. 400% growth year over year. That is unbelievably impressive. Thank you so much for joining us today and sharing your guys' story and what you guys are doing to help people make money. Thanks so much. It's great to be here, Kyle. All right, everybody, we're signing off here. Again, Kyle Bazzi, president at Benzinga, bringing you the Benzinga FinTech Awards. Uh, great interview here with Betterment. Check them out. You can go to uh, BenzingaFinTechAwards.com to vote for them and also see interviews from dozens of other companies trying to help put more greenbacks in your pocket. That's going to do it for today. We'll see you next time.